sweet tacos today. Quieres lingua? Yes. That's lingua. So I have beef tongue. Lingua. I'm willing to try lingua today. I heard it has a distinct flavor, but it absorbs. Okay. We are at the table eating some of the food that we've ordered. Frank is going back in to check on his order. Fitz, just go over what I have specifically. Leti actually ordered the taquitos, how is it? A la mexicana. A la mexicana, which is taquitos, Mexican veggies, taquitos. Mexican taquitos translated, but it has a lot of different things going on. 
We're going to look into that in a little bit. I have here three tacos, um, asada, lengua, lengua. ¿Quieres lengua? No. <laughs> no. Lengua, and right here is carnitas. No, no, I'll store. I'll put store. <laughs> <laughs> and then I have the hard shell right here. Wow. And of course, you guys know I'm allergic to cilantro, so I have all this cilantro and onion on the side. Just in case that you or anyone else wants more. So I have lingua. I'm willing to try lingua today. And then, <laughs> carne asada. Shock your audience for what lingua is. Oh, yeah, lingua is the beef tongue. It's beef tongue. Yes. Beef tongue! <laughs> and then I have a carnitas. And it's a street taco. That's right, we're having street tacos today. Luis is going to have... So I ordered three, <laughs> <laughs> so I ordered three tacos. One is asada. Okay. The other is carnitas. And the last one is, I believe it's al pastor. El pastor, yeah. el pastor. And then Frank? Frank. I have fish tacos with a wonderful fish uh, seasoning on top. I went with the hard shells, beef, uh, tacos also, and they're one of the best hard shell tacos I can get on this side of LA. I also got a hard shell oh, Al Pastor, wow. fully loaded. And my wife can't live without the beef tacos with the so with the taco shells. Nice. And then she's gonna load them up when we get home. With she usually puts about two or three ounces of red sauce. <laughs> nice. Makes a wet burrito. All of right. Tacos. And just let you guys know, we all. A lot of us got drinks. I got here horchata just like Julian. I got, got. horchata. Oh Jamaica. Water. Water. H2O. 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 Jamaica for me also. There we go. Right. And thank you for the invitation today. Yes. Yeah. Cheers. 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 Yes. All right. Mm. Mm. It's good. They do a good job. So those of you guys that don't, if you guys don't remember who Frank is, he is... Frank is an artist. If you guys don't know, definitely check out the last video we've done because he is the teapot creator. The Camellia Square, <laughs> where we enjoyed s the food roll. at Summer Rolls. Yeah, That's right. right. Mm -hmm. uh, the video will be linked up in here the, somewhere. Yeah, in the screen somewhere here or in the link in the description box below. And by the way, I saw Tony yesterday at Summer Rolls oh. and he had a great time with you over there. Oh. Awesome, yes. awesome. Glad to hear. Love it, yeah. love it. All right, let's begin. All right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Eat, eat, eat. <laughs> so, how about this? Yeah. You just start everything off yeah. with a bag. Do the lengua together. Mm. Lengua. This is lengua. It looks yeah, like tougher. Yeah. That's definitely lengua. You can see. Lingua. I'm willing to try lingua today. Oh yeah, lingua is the beef tongue. It's beef tongue. Yeah. It's, it's, That's lingua. Yeah, the cuts yeah. are bigger mm -hmm. and yeah. Picture time. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. Okay. The cuts are bigger. Okay. You you won't notice anything strange about it. <laughs> All right. Until you start moving. Okay. Okay. Ah! <laughs> there it goes. Cheers. Cheers. Andale pues, muchacho. Okay. The lengua moment. <laughs> lengua. All right. Let's go. One, two, two three. Mmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mmm. Impressions? Go ahead. Ladies first? Everyone's always like, oh my god, you're gonna eat beef tongue? This is pretty good though. I'm surprised. It's tasty. It's tasty. You have good pepper. Uh huh. Texture, a little bit of chewiness, but it needs hot sauce. Oh. So go. is this a hotter one or the green one? The is green hotter? one's a little hotter. Uh, I'll, I'll do so it. So just try a little bit on mm. a dip on one or the other, and just try each one piece at a time. So when I think of beef tongue, I thought it would be nasty, right? Because that's what you think of. Yeah, but that's gamey. And something yeah, gamey. Yeah. But this is actually tastes pretty good. Yeah. Go in for a second bite. Okay. Cheers. 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 Mm. 
That red sauce, huh? Mm. It's not bad at all. Chano's red sauce is the best. Mm. Oh, My wife God. used to order a quart of red sauce at a time to take home. <laughs> and then she put it on all the rest of her food. And then you watch her face turn red. It was a beautiful sight. <laughs> <laughs> it stays with you, but it's good. Mm -hmm. It's strong though, right? That's a little spicy. <laughs> the red one? Wow. Oh, red one? Oh. Oh, yeah. Okay. Luis needs to try it. Oh, Luis is getting I, I excited. Really I'm eyeing the, soft, the hot sauce. All right, the green sauce, the red sauce is spicy. It stays on your tongue. I never That's the thing about it. The lingua stays on your lingua? The lingua stays on the lingua <laughs> right there. There you go. Okay, let's go with the green, green sauce. Yeah, it was a little spicy. Mmm. I'm not used to it being this spicy. Mmm. I'm glad I have my horchata. <laughs> Did you say that? <laughs> yeah. Because sometimes I just use it to dip my chips. Mmm. And I don't like spicy. It's mm. spicier? But it doesn't have that much flavor. That has a lot of flavor to it. Mm. Yeah, this one has a lot of flavor and a lot of, um, like, it hits you. This one is just spicy, like, attacking your tongue. That mm. one, like, pokes it, gives you a nice groove, and then goes into the kill. This is just spicy. Mm. Yeah, the red one, I think it just really goes good with this type of food. Yeah. Mm. And so just use a little bit less of it next time. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, let's eat party. Did you have a tequila? Okay. You just get to it. So first thing I'm gonna try it without the hot sauce, and then I'm gonna try it. With. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. Nice, so. I heard it has a distinct flavor, but it absorbs uh, flavor also. Yeah, I think the thing is, eating it in taco, it kind of blends in, but if you eat the piece by itself, mm -hmm. you get a different taste. Right. Mm -hmm. There we go. Thumbs up? Nice. I thought you knew you by now. <laughs> <laughs> I see him in all your videos. Yeah. <laughs> I like the top. Not bad. Mm -hmm. You're gonna have to grow extra cows just for you now. <laughs> Up the store. I like the apple store. Mm. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. the red apple. You like the red? The red one. The green? Oh yeah. Oh, oh. so then he just puts it all over again. <laughs> it's hot. Ah, for the extra. <laughs> the green is strong, so just a little bit. Just a little bit. Just like that. Okay. Just a bite. Just a just a taste. I just learned how to do selfie sex. Mm. Mm. <laughs> so what do you think? So how long have you been coming here to Chano? Am I saying it right? Chano. Chano, right? Yeah. Uh -huh. I've been coming here about 27 years. <clears throat> wow. My nursery business is across the street. Mm -hmm. and the whole crew just walks over and has lunch. Nice. It's back over there. Nice. And then I got it. It's hard to get him back to work. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, after good food. <laughs> has it always been this small? It has been, yeah. Nice. Uh, they had several other locations. Okay. But 
I personally prefer the, the style of the cooking and the chef here. So ah. even between the different locations, this one always has been my favorite. Nice, mm. nice. So, yeah, when we were talking, when Judea was talking to the person there, yeah. this place has actually been open for, was it 70 years? Yeah. Yeah. 70 years. Establishment. Seven zero? Seven zero. I thought she said 17. <laughs> <laughs> That's why you weren't impressed. You're yeah. like, oh, it's okay. <laughs> well, I've been coming 27, so that's half the time. Yeah. Nice. Hey, just thinking about it 70 years ago. This Those fish tacos are fully loaded. Mm. Look at that. Uh, yeah, I was looking, I was looking at the, uh, on the thing, the what? fish and shrimp tacos. Yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, the shrimp, shrimp tacos are really good too. Mm. 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 Now see with my carnitas taco, three taco. I want more of the sauce. More of the red one. Mm. Uh -huh. But the lingua didn't need <laughs> any sauce, to be honest. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I was surprised because you would think drink that thing with sauce, I think, because it's beef tongue. <laughs> but, <laughs> but yeah. I'm getting full already though. Yeah. <laughs> want two tacos because the mm -hmm. tortillas are really fresh and like they're big. big and, yeah, they're and big. big. Yeah. A lot of other taco places that I've ever gone to, they're street small. taco, are small. And yeah. by this time, folding it like this, it'll tear up or right. like fold down. Yeah, mm -hmm. it'll break. Yeah. But this, both of them are staying like solid. So. Yeah. Now this is a flour tortillas. Corn. 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 Mm -hmm. yeah. Handmade. Mm -hmm. You can tell though that it's mm -hmm. handmade. Yeah, that's why it's not falling apart. Cause it's handmade with love. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Friday, Saturday, Sunday, they're uh. handmade right here behind us on, mm -hmm. the, on the grill. Okay. Uh, usually cool. around lunchtime, and then they uh, clean everything up. Mm. The Sunday afternoon is when they won't work late. Mm. Mm. Oh, and what that means is mm -hmm. you can just come in here to buy tortillas. Oh really? Yeah. It's not like they're ma hand making them only for the restaurant. Oh, oh, just come on in and order as many of the um, handmade tortillas as you're interested in. And oh take cool! You with you. Wow! <laughs> That's good to know. Mm -hmm. And then we just talked to someone earlier who came from what, Fontana all the way from Fontana out to Temple City for these tacos? Yes. Yes. The whole yes. family and the whole works too. Right. Yep. <clears throat> Are you liking this content? Definitely hit the red subscribe button and the bell if this is actually entertaining. How often do you try to go out? Mm. Well, this week, yesterday we went to Umami Burger because they were giving out Umami Burgers for free. Mm. Where's yeah. that at? Uh, we ha um, right in our neighborhood of Thousand Oaks. Mm. But they have 28 locations worldwide. <clears throat> so it's a huge chain. How was the wait? And it's gonna be a one hour and a half wait. But hey, it's gonna be worth it because it's umami burger. An hour and a half wait. Uh -huh. yeah, that, but it was worth the wait. Was, mm -hmm. it, was it a special occasion? Yes, they have rolled out a new menu. Oh, oh okay. okay. So they wanted to yeah, relax it out. Oh, yes. That was the only way for me to have Wagyu beef hamburger that's $15 for free. <laughs> wow. I enjoyed that. Oh, yeah. but I, I don't know, for us it was like, we knew it was going to be a long way, and especially in our area it would have been even longer, and we're like, no, uh. we, by the time we got out of work was work, like the time I, I got the email from you, and that was like 37, yeah. Uh -huh. no. Yeah. But we, I don't know, we go lucky if we eat out maybe three times a month. Mm -hmm. We try to stay in and cook and cook, do cooking videos. Oh, good. <laughs> so every time we go out to eat is for videos. <laughs> that's what, that's yeah. what that's what's wondering. <laughs> yeah. All right, so this is gonna be the hard taco. This is your recommendation. Mm -hmm. uh, yeah. So show. Yes. Just the right amount of crunch. Oh, it looks like it. And, look, and it's also yeah. good. It's very crunchy. Usually a yeah. lot of hard, yeah. hard shell. Like by this yeah. time, this is already soggy, but right. or broken. And it won't fall apart after you chew on it either. Right there. We're gonna bet money on that, right? 
I'm just kidding. <laughs> lunch. No, 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 lunch. Lunch, lunch. <laughs> Nice, man. That's awesome. It's the handmade tortillas. I really think so. It's always a, the tortillas that makes it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, the food isn't as greasy as some that I've eaten. Uh -huh. That helps a lot also. Uh -huh. But it's not dry. Uh huh. And it's very consistent here. Mm. I'm getting full already. Everything is filling. Really the fact that the meat is falling out of taco mm -hmm. says a lot. Like a lot of places they don't fill it up. Mm -hmm. I'm excited about the food. Yeah. Yeah. I'm excited about the food. Yeah. Definitely a generous portion. Mm -hmm. Ken, the way your beef is shredded there, mm -hmm. you can really tell it's a good quality. Oh yeah. Ingredient. Yeah. Yeah. Cleaning out my sinuses. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't remember it being this hot. <laughs> Worth the drive? <laughs> so yeah, we don't go out much. <laughs> we eat a lot of home I, I don't know, for some reason I've been wanting to do a leg with light like try leg. I've seen other people do it, I'm like, alright, we're gonna try it. Mm -hmm. Now we need to find a good place that has cabeza. Cabeza? Cabeza, head. Oh, wow. <laughs> <laughs> what? Laughing, yeah. <laughs> I know what that is. Yeah. What is tripas? Tripe. Tripe? Mm. 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 The thing that you don't like in fun, right? Wow. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Whoa. <laughs> That's a food adventure for sure. <laughs> so in the fall, uh -huh. Originally, I'm from Pennsylvania, but when it starts to cool off, my family always made a a plate which was um, tongue, head meats, mm. um, different parts of things, and they would put it into something like a jello, oh, okay. a flavorless thing that they would get from the animals also, and put it in a bowl and put it in the basement mm. where it would sit for a couple of days in the cold, oh. and it would gel up. Mm. And they call the sults. Huh. And you can buy a lunch meat here called the head cheese. Mm -hmm. You ever had head cheese? Mm -hmm. It's kind of a similar type of thing. And it was really good. Mm. There goes the audio. Just our neighbors. <laughs> Just our neighbors. <laughs> and even their avocados. Awesome. A lot of people don't do it that well. I've had my three tacos, and you'd be surprised which one I like the best. Lengua. Lengua. Oh, yeah, you got Go it. For it. Oh, Crazy, huh? How about you? <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's why she's going to request that at home now. <laughs> <laughs> now I'm going to be trying uh, lingua everywhere else, but I'm pretty sure this is the place that's going to be forever remembered as the best. Yeah. Remember, my first lingua was here. And I liked it! Crazy! <laughs> yeah. You just have to get out of your own head sometimes. <laughs> yep. And how about you? What was your favorite? The leg was good, but eating it by itself is uh, just... Here, you guys can try it by yourself. <laughs> <laughs> they don't want to try. I'll take a piece. Oh, there okay, you go. There. there goes Frank. <laughs> just like Langua. <laughs> delicious. There you go. <laughs> but yeah, I think it's pretty good. Good in mm -hmm. a taco, but then by itself it's just very mm -hmm. isolated. Mm -hmm. right. It's still good. It's just very distinct. Mm. <laughs> the flan. Time for the flan. Yeah. That's what's even like. I had to try it, have to oh, get it, because it's homemade fun. Yes? Yes. Yep. Yes. Cheers.
Yeah, get some of that sauce. Do you want a bite? Do you want a spoon? Mmm. Mm -hmm. Caramelly. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh, it looks good. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, it's really good. It, it's firm, firm. Mm -hmm. Without being uh, mushy. Yeah. Very good. Thank you. Mm -hmm. The glaze is not too yeah, sweet. Yeah, that's what I was mm -hmm. gonna say. The glaze is not too sweet. It's They're really not um, like um, I don't know, just good. <laughs> I think it's one of the best blondes I've ever had. Mmm, mmm. Yeah, I really like it. Yeah. yeah. It's up there. Okay. I like this. Snapshot. Hi. Okay. Yeah. I'm full. <laughs> Good portions. Uh-huh. Yeah. And I got a churro on top of it. Uh oh. <laughs> I know. That's why I'm like. That was the first thing you ordered. <laughs> <laughs> she walked in the door, churros and flan. <laughs> you didn't think the tacos were gonna be this big? No, I did not expect it to be very big. I'm so used to very small. Um, all right. The churros is very warm still. Oh. Yeah. You want to break a piece I, and have some? I, 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 have a, I have a piece too thick one. Dad, look how big my teeth are and a fire dog. How about you, Kenna? You want a bite? No. Okay. Let's have a bite. Ooh, that's big. Hey, hey, ready? Ready. Great. Cheers. Wow. Here you go. Mm. Good trip. Wow. I like, for me personally, I like doughy food. Mmm! But having that soft center on there, yeah, it's, it's like still that. extra crispy on the outside. It's really like a vanilla pudding in the center. Uh, almost. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah. Alright. Your turn, baby. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> what I want. Let me hold it for you two guys. Oh, okay. I'll get you both in the frame. Ready? Yeah. Is it on? Yeah. We're gonna be in it too, but please, okay? Okay. <laughs> Go for it, really. Okay. Go for it. You gonna try the flop. Oh, fast cooker! Yeah? Oh, yeah. Tasty. Mmm. Velvety and smooth. Thumbs up. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying. I'm trying. <laughs> nice. Well, I'm glad you liked it all. Yes. Oh, the churros. Oh, now you're gonna try the Oh, I thought you didn't want the churros. <laughs> oh. <laughs> that's, I think that's gonna go first. On the ride home. There we go. Mmm. Nom nom nom. Good. Right. It has the right amount of crisp to it. It does. Uh -huh. mm. Soft in the center. Good. Cool. So I've never had the churro here. Really? No. Oh. And then that looked like it was a pudding inside. Yeah. So I just thought I had a, a moist. But when you bit into it, I saw the actual pudding come out. <laughs> yeah, it's I was like, filling. Yeah. Wow, I didn't, I didn't realize. Yeah. Churros don't usually have, do they? I don't think so. I don't know. No, no, no. It's just a fried have like custard. Yeah, I mean, the new, the new trendy thing is stuffed churros. Oh, okay. Mm. So that's what you had. A dollar fifty, and they're homemade. <laughs> Handmade, mm. homemade. Fresh made. Freshly made here. Everything's freshly made here. It's freshly made. Yeah, so yeah. love that. Mm -hmm. What's really nice when I'm busy, I just call ahead on my drive past and I'll head home. I just call ahead 10, 10 minutes, indoor, back out. Mm. Nice. Not known for the environs right here, <laughs> <laughs> but it's safe and comfortable, especially when you have a group of people here. Mm -hmm. yes. Family friendly too. Yeah, I love it. 
Love it. Oh, just keep going. <laughs> yep. Sweet. So the cross streets are Las Tunas Drive and Willard. Okay. So the halfway between San Gabriel Boulevard and Roseby Boulevard. Oh, yeah. Going north and south. So I'm looking straight at Las Tunas Drive. Right. Looking north. Yeah. Las Tunas San Gabriel on the left. Boulevard and Roseby Boulevard on the right. Which is where the Camellia Square was. Okay. Yeah. Where we were. Uh -huh. yeah, it's about, about a quarter, quarter mile to the west. Okay. Las Tunas Drive is a very busy street here. Yeah. It's so when you're looking, busy. make sure to uh, have the GPS on a couple miles away from here. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's a small. Because you will drive back and forth here yeah. to find the spot. Okay. <laughs> it's a small little corner shop. Yes. So thank you, Frank, for coming out and recommending this place. It was an honor being here with you, yeah. and it's been a lot of fun. Thank you for the call and inviting me over to see you a second time. Yes. <laughs> definitely, definitely. And I hope we can meet up again yeah. and have another great meal. Yep. Absolutely. Yeah. I like that one. That one was good. Take another bite. I know. Then you just throw in, I'm on the sugar high. <laughs> Maybe I'll just use that one. It's <laughs> like, <laughs> man. All right, well, um, let's see. <laughs> Are you blanking out? Yeah. Two hands on the sugar high. This is the first one I've seen you She's in blanked out. Oh, oh boy. You're like... What do I like to say on my YouTube channel? I forget. I'm going to have to finish this churro for you. I know. <laughs> All right, guys. All my haters, if you are definitely watching this video and got through all the way to this end, thank you so much. We appreciate you. Definitely hit the red subscribe button and the bell so you could be an hater too. And since you're right there, might as well hit the like button. Hey, if you like Hannah and if you like Frank, definitely check out their videos. Yep, Frank has a video. I will leave the link in the description box below. And Hannah's channel, I will definitely put the subscribe here somewhere in the screen. All right, so what do I like to say to end the video? Always expand your mind and explore your palate and let's keep chasing the flavor, my haters. I'll see you in the next video. I think I did pretty good. Very good. <laughs> well said. Yes. Good. Thank you, Frank, for coming here. Oh, you're welcome. Yeah. Yeah, it was fun. And hanging out with us. <laughs> Breaks up my day, something new. Nice, <laughs> nice. That was an Instagram moment for a second. You're gonna be a mountain man. <laughs> I used to have a beard. Go hunting. Go hunting and yeah. draw a map on the walls. Just throw, shoot arrows. I was there. There you go. Yeah. I'm gonna be doing a shout out next from my last uploaded video. Stay tuned. Did you know that we did a cookbook? Check out our link in the description box below. Which one is that again? Check out Hannah's link down below.